Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I'm doing another college day in my life and it's Thursday. So I have SI at 10.30 and then at 1.30 I have college algebra. Then at three o'clock I have a doctor's appointment. But before all of that, I'm going to Starbucks because I really need to get my medical term homework done. It's already Thursday. I haven't done any of my homework for medical term this week. It's honestly just such a tedious class and it's not that I don't like, like it and think it's important, but it's just like time consuming. And last week I went to Starbucks and I ended up getting a lot done. So on a side note, I look like I do right now because I woke up with a sore throat and a headache and I am hoping so bad that I'm not getting sick right now because I am going to Tampa this weekend to spend some time with my sister and I don't wanna be sick. I haven't been sick in a while, so I feel like it's my time. I'm really hoping I'm not getting sick. Like, let's just hope this is nothing. I drank half a bottle of water. I took two ibuprofen. I'm trying to just like stick it out. Let's hope this is nothing. now from Starbucks and it is 926 I have supplemental instruction in an hour so I'm just gonna eat something real quick for breakfast and then do something with myself because I literally just woke up and left this morning so I'm just making one of these multi-grain waffles for breakfast and putting peanut butter on it I did this a few times this week and it was really good I don't even know what my hair is doing what is this this is a dry shampoo that I have been using. I got this at Ulta because I got the miniature version in like a subscription box and I love it so much. It smells good and it doesn't leave like a white residue in your hair. It's by Eva NYC. I really like it. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with this hair today. I haven't had a chance to tell you, but Chad's mom uh, gave us our birthday gifts last weekend and I got the Naked Honey palette, and you guys, it is so beautiful. I haven't really had a chance to use it yet, but the colors are so pretty. I can't wait to use this. I already put my It Cosmetics CC cream on this morning. I did my eyebrows. I'm literally just gonna put some eyeliner and some more mascara on and call it a day. So there's that. I have bags under my eyes because of exhaustion. So yesterday at work, we had a cardiac arrest come in, so I got to do some compressions, and that's not uncommon. I work in the ER, but I literally hurt my wrist so bad doing compressions. I did so many, and literally like still having pain in like this area and I always have like pain in my thumbs and I don't really know why sometimes when like I'm driving like the joints in my hands will hurt or if I've been typing for a long time um, anything that requires me to like grip anything so like when I'm at the gym if I'm doing like pull-ups or something like that I always get pain right here so and then doing those compressions yesterday like that hurt and we didn't end up getting the guy back and it was really sad his like wife came in and she was crying and she finally like told us we could stop and it sucked not gonna lie i have been so stressed out because of how much i need to get done and how little time there is and you guys think i have my life together which is the funniest part this is my favorite lip gloss it's not even really a lip gloss i mean it does make your lips look glossy but it's actually a lip balm these are super popular. I have the lip mask too. Here's my I don't care look for the day. When I wear something like this, I'm really trying to get stuff done that day. Like I don't care about my appearance. It's all about just a productive day. Here's my A&P slides this week. Look at these. I mean, are you serious? This is rough. Everything that's like highlighted and has stuff written on it is stuff that I need to know. And for this next exam, I have five chapters. So five packets of this with information to know. And that's only for the practical. That's not even like the AMP exam. That's just like the lab portion. Just parked, I'm about to head to SI and then I have like a two hour break in between SI and when I have to go to college algebra. So Chad and I talked about meeting for lunch. I'm so tired of eating the food on campus. So that might be really nice and I need to go to Target anyway. So I'm gonna leave during my break go get the things I need from Target, which I have written down in my phone. I can't even think of it right now. So I just got finished with SI and the instructor ended up being late. I almost left. He was like, 
13 minutes late and I was only gonna stay 15 minutes and then I was gonna leave and then he showed up which I get it like he's a student too so I'm sure like you know he had something important going on that's why he was late but it sucks because we didn't get through the whole worksheet and now I am heading to Target I need to get makeup wipes deodorant there's a couple other things I need to get and then I'm probably gonna meet Chad for lunch I'm at Target right now and I'm at the book section. I really want to find a book to start reading at night. There's so many. I want to get one of the nonfiction bestsellers. Just like something to read at night instead of being on my phone because I feel like I will sleep better and it's just like a healthy habit to read in the evening. I was looking at a bunch online. I'm trying to find one that I saw online if it's here. This is the one I'm going to get. It's called One Day in December by Josie Silver. It's kind of like a romance book um, with like some suspense. I read the back. I don't know. It sounded good. Target already has some of their Christmas stuff out in the dollar section. And I just found these ornaments. And I think I'm going to get this one, this little tree. And I will explain to you guys why later. It's part of Chad's birthday gift. How cute. Those are little elf slippers. It's all like scattered with like school stuff. And then over here we have fall stuff, little Christmas, just a bunch of different stuff here. Hi Chad. Hey. We're having lunch and I got a chicken Slovakia. It's like a Greek pita. It's really good. It has feta cheese and black olives and chicken, tzatziki sauce, super good. And then we got garden salsa sun chips because those are the best. I just finished having lunch with Chad and whenever we do that, like whenever we get lunch together and then we drive separate, you know, like we just met for lunch, it always takes me back in time like four years ago when we were very early in our relationship. I mean, I guess five years ago technically, but and we would like meet for lunch and stuff and we like didn't live together. We were so young and innocent. <laughs> I could go for a nap right now if I had time, but I don't. I got done with class like 10 minutes ago and I had like 30 minutes to kill until my appointment at student health. So I went to Tropical Smoothie and picked up an Island Green. I thought a green smoothie would be good for me right now. I'm back home now obviously and I am so dumb. I literally just recorded a whole video before I wrapped this stuff showing you guys what I got Chad for his birthday this year and then I realized I plan on uploading this vlog tonight so I can't show you because then he might see it when he watches my vlog. These two gifts are for Chad and these two gifts are for my sister. And don't judge the very girly wrapping paper. We already had this wrapping paper and these bags, I like recycle all of my gift bags and yeah, I tried not to buy anything new. So I just used what I had. Hopefully Chad won't mind that it's kind of girly. <laughs> I'm making an iced coffee and I'm using this organic cold brew oat milk latte. And this is ginger snap flavored. I got it from Target and I showed you guys on my Instagram stories. And it's seriously so good. Somebody DM'd me and told me they got it and really liked it too. It is like super gingery though. So you have to like that like spice. But I think if you like pumpkin spice, then you'll like it. So I just went through all of the diagrams that I need to know for my practical. These are the same ones that I've been studying over the last few weeks on each of the lab quizzes, but some of them aren't included for this, so I just X'd those. And then instead of just having like six different packets, because these are all from different chapters, and it was all mixed up like answer keys, I just cut them out and put them on the back of each one so I can just fill them in and check. So it's like a really nice little system. I got pretty much everything that I'm gonna get done tonight done. I'm having a really hard time focusing, so I just told Chad that I'm giving up, so we're gonna watch TV and relax for a little bit. Then I'm waking up at 6 a.m. and doing it all over again. I'm gonna finish all my medical term stuff tomorrow, and then we're leaving for Tampa, and I'm gonna vlog our whole weekend. So if you guys are not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button, and I'll see you in my next video.